and we were just getting hated on so bad because the videos were so bad, but they had great titles and thumbnails. So we were getting a lot of views, but we were getting almost no subscribers at that moment. And the hate sucked. It really was brutal. I've had everything said about me that any person could possibly say about a human being during that rise to say 50,000 subscribers or 100,000 subscribers. Like I call it the gauntlet because people were so ruthless and so just, they just wanted you to fail so badly. When you're in that grind from zero to 100,000 subscribers, no one wants you to win besides maybe your girlfriend and your friends. Maybe some of your friends don't even want you to win. And uh, I did, I just, sometimes at night would, you know, it would, it would definitely hit and I would wonder if this is all right, you know, if this is smart. And then, you know, you'd have a really bad week of videos where your views sucked and you don't know if it's gonna be enough money to, to really support the, the upcoming plans you have. And it sucked, you know, and, and a few, different times but i always just was so excited to work on my car and, and make it faster that that was that's what dragged me through to get to that over that ridge of where i then had enough people supporting me and, and positive comments that when someone would say like you know look at this ugly idiot you know it's just some hurtful thing like then i had enough people that would jump in there and be like hey i like this guy leave him alone and that's when things, you know, kind of started to take a positive turn in my comment section. And I was like, all right, we're fired up. And, and that's, I guess, where I, I caught that break mentally to just full send it.